Greetings, Dennis Daniels here. This is a quick tutorial on how to get uh, LibreOffice to import multiple images as a photo album like presentation. So let's uh, open up LibreOffice here and we're going to impress. <coughs> I've already installed it and you can see it's photo album for zip and all you have to do <clears throat> literally don't unzip it don't do anything uh, install tools extension manager and just add the whole unpacked zip archive and then uh, I'll show you the next part so this part is straightforward don't worry about it uh, let's go ahead and create there it is and now let's refer back to our tools add-ons create photo album so tools add-ons create photo album and what we're looking for is pictures and I'm just going to load the webcam here um, and the, the UI is a little funky it doesn't really tell you what it's going to do uh, and it may not actually work oh it did work so um, and I don't know quite how to control the order of the images as they're loaded uh, but of course you can move them around as much as you like uh, if you do slide sorter hopefully those images will load well, that's kind of funny uh, alright so it's actually LibreOffice is actually having trouble loading the uh, slides uh, that's no good. Well, LibreOffice. Um, well, now we know. It just, uh, let's move this one to the top and see. All right. Yeah, that's a bummer. LibreOffice uh, won't load the images. <coughs> what you're looking at there is a uh, image magic convert charcoal. So, uh, anyway, thanks for watching, and if you want to load up, uh, oh, that was weird. Ah, you know why? Because it automatically started a slideshow in the background. So it was having trouble processing all of the same things at the same time. I just, hmm. And look at that. LibreOffice is open over here, too. I didn't do that. Interesting. Okay, so now we can move these around as much as we want. <clears throat> Looks like it works. Thanks for watching. And again, you can get your PowerPoint, or rather your um, LibreOffice and OpenOffice, to load photo albums as slideshows. Now, the next step, of course, is <clears throat> not that we necessarily want to see this, but how do we export all of this as an SWF? That's the next question. Hopefully I'll find an answer. Thanks for watching and happy computing.